<laughs> I don't think motorcycle cops should be allowed to give you a ticket for not wearing a seatbelt. <laughs> that just seems wrong to me. I've been trying to figure out how the economy works. So I've been watching CNBC. It seems like everybody comes on and says the same thing. They're like, listen, you guys just need to have confidence in the economy and the economy will be good. And I'm like, how the fuck is that how it works? That seems completely backwards. That's like if I went to my girlfriend, I was like, baby, listen, you just need to start thinking I'm an amazing boyfriend. You just need to believe deep down that I am a fantastic boyfriend and our relationship will be good. You know? that's, that's how it works though. That's how it works. We have a confidence-based financial system, right? We have a confidence-based economy, and that makes me feel like a confidence man, you know? Do you guys know the term confidence man? No? Do you know the abbreviated version? Con man? Did you know that? You know that's what that's short for? That's what it stands for. Because a con man, he gets you to have confidence in him, and then he fucks you over, right? So these guys are just telling us we just need to have confidence in the economy. I think they're going to fuck us over. I don't know. I think that's the only way this ends. So my buddies think it's, uh, the problem is that like, we went off the gold standard, and now they can just print all this money. That's what they tell me the problem is. And I'm like, all right, well, let's go back to the gold standard. I'm like, no, we can't can't do that, that's impossible. I'm like, all right, well, let's figure out something to back our money up with. And we were thinking about it, we couldn't really figure out, but then on Valentine's Day, my girlfriend gave me this coupon. It's like, this coupon, redeemable for one free blowjob. <laughs> and I had it in my hand, I was like, all right, this is a valuable piece of paper right here. This is the, I'm gonna put this somewhere safe. <laughs> Make sure nothing happens to us. That just makes me think, like, do you think we could have, like, a blowjob back currency, maybe? Like, if money printing is the issue, let's just make a rule that Jerome Powell owes somebody a blowjob for every dollar they print. I think they might shut off those machines pretty quickly. Fuck off somewhere, I got work to do.